Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study about context-free grammar to push down automata. We know that push down automata accepts context-free language. And context-free language is generated by context-free grammar. Then, if a context-free grammar is given to us, then we can construct a push down automata which will accept the language generated by this context free grammar. Now suppose there is a context free grammar G described by the quadruple VDPS. Now we have to construct a push down automata M. M will accept the language generated by context-free grammar G by empty stack. So, how we will construct a pushdown automata M which will accept the language generated by this context-free grammar G by empty stack? First of all, we will convert this grammar G into GNF. Push down automata M will have only one state that is Q. Right? It will have only one state. Push down automata M will have only one state. And the start symbol of grammar G will be the stack start symbol in push down automata M. All variables of grammar G will be stack symbols of pushdown automata M and all terminals of grammar G will be input symbols of pushdown automata M. Now since we have converted the context free grammar G into GNF so its all productions will be in this form a derives a gamma where gamma is a either a string of variables or empty string right gamma will either be a string of variables or empty string now for each production a derives a gamma of grammar g we will make a transition delta q a a equals to q gamma in push down automata m right it would be more clear after this example suppose there is a context free grammar g in gnf it is described by the quadruple V T P S, right? And P is the set of these productions. These are the productions in grammar G, right? S is the start symbol of grammar G. Now we have to construct a push down automata M which will accept the language generated by this grammar G by empty stack. First of all, push down automata M will have only one state Q, right? The start symbol S of grammar G will be a stack a start symbol in push down automata M. The start symbol of uh, grammar G will be stack start symbol in push down automata m and all variables of g will be stack symbols of push down automata m and all terminals of grammar g will be input symbols in push down automata m now See this production as derives a 
A2 right for this production we will add a transition in push down automata M that is delta Q A S equals to Q A 2 right now for this production as derives A A3 we will add a transition delta Q A S equals to Q A3 in push down automata M and for this production A2 derives A A2 A3 we will add a transition delta Q A A2 equals to Q A2 A3 in push down automata M and for this production A2 derives A A3 A3 we will add this transition in push down automata M delta Q A A2 equals to Q A3 A3 and for this production A3 derives B we will add this transition delta Q B A3 equals to Q empty in push down automata M so in this way we can construct a push down automata for a context free grammar thank you very much